Hey YouTube, welcome to Life of Liddy, and today we are talking about luggage locks. I found, if you, if I can get this to focus, it will say fortress there, I found this little fortress lock actually on my, uh, my partner's suitcase as she's going away soon, uh, and I thought, well, I wonder how hard it is to pick, and sure enough, as I'll demonstrate in a little bit, it's, it's not too difficult. So, I was a little bit disappointed with that, so I went to the hardware store and I bought a pack of these two master locks and it says on the back here ideal, ideal for securing suitcases briefcases and travel bags and whilst I was at it I got master lock tough under fire and yeah, we can read it they're luggage locks so uh, these came in sets of two each I put these aside so I've got my old fortress which I don't even, I don't even think we have a key to uh, the master lock tough under fire and just your standard little master lock um, now if you are someone who uses luggage locks then you're obviously somewhat concerned about keeping your goods safe when you go traveling so let's just demonstrate uh, just for reference I'm using my oh, you're kidding just like that guys okay so that's the one so I am using a small skinny tension wrench and a small standard pick that I made, uh, or in fairness it is probably smaller than a standard size, so we'll call it a small hook. Uh, and this is the second one, so this looks to be a bit of a three pinner. Uh, uh, there we go again guys. As you can see they're uh, not really a challenge at all, it's, it is a, a bit disappointing. Not that these were expensive. Um, but it does say it is suitable or ideal in uh, in one of them. It says ideal for luggage. Well, the reality is it's just not ideal for anything. They're just not good enough. I'm not trying to have a go at the manufacturer. Uh, okay. There we go. Um, look, this isn't necessarily a video that uh, anyone, any aspiring picker is going to learn anything from. I just, I just want to put it out there. So if anyone is thinking of putting locks on their suitcases or luggage or their brief cases, realistically, it's not going to stop anything. Anyone can get the, get a hold of just something like this. This is a, um, this is a hacksaw blade that I made. Uh, realistically, okay, I understand. I put a little bit of time into this. Probably took me maybe an hour. But anyone could do something that looks vaguely similar like this in about five minutes. This is a standard tension wrench. You can make them out of white for blades in search. You can buy them for two dollars on eBay. Anyone can get their hands on these, and it's just going to go straight through this. So, if we've learned anything, guys, it's do not trust these little luggage lock locks. You uh, spend a little bit more money and get something a little bit better. All right, guys, that's life of Liddy, and have a lovely day, and I'll see you next time.